everybody, I'm Dee. And I'm Jay, and, and we, we are, are Paro DJ. DJ. And we are here today with one of the most requested informational videos in the history of mankind. We have information? That's a slight exaggeration. <laughs> well, as you know, as you may know, if you've watched our cruise series, we recently got into the Diamonds International Charm Collecting Program. I, I did. I just made those words up. <laughs> Not we. We've gone to some places and they've given me the, the charms too. I give them to other but people. But <laughs> it is a essentially free program that yeah. you can get involved in and collect free charms at most all the ports that you go to. Most. Now is this fancy fine jewelry a top tier? No. But it's fun and it's something it unique is. you can do in ports and it's like, I don't know, it's just a family thing to do. You can get all the family members together and go do that. And, yeah, have memories. Have but memories. I, I heard I heard somebody <laughs> say one time that what was it like if you had costume jewelry was up here it would be like whatever two steps below costume jewelry is probably. But it's fun and each it's port memories. has a unique charm. Yes. So at certain points in this video, I think I'm probably going to do little segments from where we've actually been in ports in the past, going in, getting the charms, showing the charms off, and all yeah. that stuff. But just an overview of the program. How do you get started in the program? So. <laughs> you can get started a couple of different ways. Um, the main one is when you're leaving the ship, you get a shopping map, and in that shopping map, generally in every port, almost, there's a Diamonds International. There's a coupon for a free charm bracelet. And your charm bracelet originally... It comes with ignore one all this. free charm. It's just this bracelet right. and it has the oh my the di I will put pictures <laughs> charm in. rather than trying to fight like the that. camera to focus yeah. i will insert some photos it but... has the di charm right. and then what they say is you have to purchase your first charm which is supposed to be five dollars right it's your first port mm -hmm. in the di shop and then after that every charm after that is free I don't know that that's actually true. If you have cute children with you. <laughs> we have found, yeah. You can just go get the charm bracelet and they'll give you the charm for free. Yeah, we recently <laughs> on our Carnival Liberty cruise, the family that we were cruising with, they didn't have the, I think they got the coupon, which you can also get the coupon from the, there's usually a brochure rack mm -hmm. by the shopping desk. If, that's the other way, yeah. yeah. Uh, and we just all went into the Diamonds International. They had the coupon. There were like four kids and the mom and they were like, can we have? And they just gave them the free bracelet, and free charm. starter charm, free everything. The free <laughs> Cozumel charm, or Cozumel, free Nassau charm. Nassau. That's where we were. Yeah. Uh, and they didn't even have to pay the $5. So you might not have to do that. We did. I remember them taking our five dollars. In Cozumel, it was my first time. <laughs> yeah. It was the yeah, but like you said, most of the ports have them. I think some of the more common ones that you might go to that don't have a free port, free port does not on. currently have one. Amber Cove. Mm. Oh. I think they. Do. You know what? We didn't get one. Yeah. The um, only the only major one I know of that a lot of people go to that they don't have one, obviously other than the private islands, right, is Freeport. So okay. and that might change in the future. I'm trying to think. Uh, you're, you're probably right. On probably that. so. I don't know. But I'm going to throw some random footage in now <laughs> of just us being at ports and getting charms and what ones we got at certain ports and things like that. So, mm -hmm. editing me, roll the montage! Look at all that beautiful footage. Wasn't that amazing? So good. It was nice, like, just reliving it. Yeah, but that's all you really need to get started is the coupon from the ship, mm -hmm. which is free. And then you might want to take $5 in case they make you pay it, but you might luck out and not have to pay it. So Just make sure you take your bracelet with you in the port. That ports. is true. Um, 
on every cruise. I always have it in my backpack or I'm wearing it, depends on what we're doing. Just put it on or just carry it in there and ask for the charm. And fun tip is some ports have two mm. Diamonds International that have different charms. This is true. Um, St. Martin, Martin is, one. is one of them and Belize had two. Mm. What's yep. our cat doing? Our cats are trying to interrupt the video. <laughs> He's trying to knock As the always. lights down onto the camera. Please don't. Ah! Uh, but Belize had two different ones, and then they said in NASA that there was two, but we did not find that to be true. No, we went to the second location, they told us we could get a different type of charm, and that did not turn out to be true. Yeah. But hey, give it a try. And don't feel bad about going in and just asking no. for it. That's what the program's about. If you want to buy jewelry while you're there, great. But I haven't found them to be overly pushy or not anything like that. You just go in and walk past all the salespeople or ask where you can get it. It's usually at the back. It's in the back, yeah. And uh, it's just fun. I like all the different charms and like animals and things that you get. Yeah, it usually relates to the port that yep. you're in. But yeah, most of the time the Diamonds International people are not pushy. Now no. some of the other places you go to get freebies with coupons, they'll want they're you to try pushy. on jewelry and do other yeah, things. you don't have to do that. Usually Diamonds International is just like, yes, here you go, bye. Exactly. You know, they do a lot of business. Oh yeah. And they give out a lot of these charms. Oh, another thing is, it's a good idea to open it and try and put it on because mm -hmm. I have had some that, I mean, they're very inexpensive. They're inexpensive. Made that did not open or the clasp is like too big and wouldn't close. Yes. Um, or we went to put one on one time and it just broke. Yeah. So while you're standing at try the port, it. it's a good idea to do that. And then if it doesn't, they're very kind yes. about going and get a different one and just toss that one because you want something that works at the end of the day. Right. Sometimes you do have to walk a little bit to get to Diamonds International, so, mm -hmm. you know, make it worth your while. Yeah, but just show them while you're standing there, hey, my charm broke, yeah. can I please have another one? Because you hate to get back on the ship, pull away from the port, go to put it on your bracelet, it breaks, and mm -hmm. then you're going to have to wait till your next cruise to go back to that port. Yeah, I've had that happen twice. And mm -hmm. another tip is probably maybe get more than one bracelet um, if you True. cruise a lot, because they are going to fade over time. They do. They um, tarnish. They. He usually gets one, too, so I have, like, yeah. another set. Um... And you can get one in Orlando. Oh, that's right. Secret yep. location that they don't advertise. Disney Springs in Orlando yes. has a shop called something, something like of time. Luxury of Time. Yeah, it's, it's a clock. So that's what the charm in Orlando looks like at Disney Springs. You can also get them in Alaska. Oh, that's at, like, right. like three different ports. So I'm really excited to get them. Yeah, they're all over the place. Yeah, I wouldn't have thought, but yeah, they have them all over. Mm -hmm. Exciting. I know, but that's about it. So no big secret, really just get the coupon, hit up a Diamonds International and get started and then just make sure you take your bracelet with your charm on it, show it to the next people and you will continue to get free charms for life. And just to clear up a common question we get. Oh, true. Do you have to have this coupon book? You do not. To get the charms. You don't. We're going to do a separate video on this yeah, and we picked everything this up. that's included with it, how much it costs, what right. you can get. But uh, you don't need this to get the Diamonds International charms. Right. We bought that on the breeze, and we've used it a good a bit. But that's a whole separate story. Later. So, later. <laughs> uh, that's about it for this video. So hopefully you enjoyed a little bit of insight on the Diamonds International charm program. Yeah. Uh, fun little hobby. I uh, love it. Mm -hmm. It's fun. Uh, yeah, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Become a Paromaniac today. Socialize all our media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Yep. And until next time, <laughs> rock, rock on. on.